Well, I most admire what Lanam has done to create the interdisciplinary degree programs in the College of Science and in uh, the integrated science curriculum for, for our freshmen and sophomores. Uh, starting new things is always hard. Of course, he started the College of Science, and he'll be remembered for that. But I think also working against the departmental structures a bit to, uh, to envision where new research directions are headed, where we need to educate students for the future, and then to marshal faculty interest to develop these programs, to get them approved, and then to actually begin teaching students, to have the, the vision and the energy to, to uh, inspire faculty to work in these directions, I think is really a landmark achievement that Virginia Tech will remember for decades to come. Interdisciplinary Science is something Lainam has always been a strong advocate for. So it's, um, it's easy to say, it's much harder to implement. So the vision that Lainam had for bringing disciplines together, like we have in this building, is a, is a key component, because he always said the most exciting science is on the, the boundaries of where different fields overlap. And uh, you see that between biology, chemistry, geosciences, and many, many other, other disciplines, physics, of course. But I think the thing, again, that strikes me about Lainam, he was always thinking about 10 to 15 years ahead of everyone else, including myself on where we should be going. 15, 20 years ago, he was talking about integrated science. Um, long ago, he was talking about the importance of neuroscience. So he had the vision to kind of take an idea well before its time, stick with it until the timing was appropriate, and then move aggressively on it. And I think in doing so, He's made some significant impacts on this university. Lainam is a, a peculiar and fascinating person. He's a brilliant uh, physicist, uh, studies astrophysics. He's a scholar of the utmost perfection, uh, a very demanding person of uh, himself and those around him. And he brings a sense of excellence but also a sense of humor to everything he does. And I think those are qualities that bring out the best in any individual, including myself, working with him, because it's always a pleasure to work with him. You feel like you're working on an important project, you're working towards high standards, and you do it with joy. And he was obviously the founding dean uh, that has set the place up uh, for success. And so. He's had a, an impact there, and he's done it in a way that recognizes the nature of higher education, the importance of higher education. Um, he's always been a person that has been able to interpret the trends and dynamics on campus and place them in context of national and international circumstances. And so he has a great feel for higher education. Well, I think that Dean Chang provided a, a thoughtful and steady hand that contributed in a very significant way to the evolution of the College of Science. We began this process back in 2002 when the university was subjected to uh, reducing its budget by $76 million. And at the same time, we were embarking on a program to expand our research activities significantly. And so he was a key participant in doing that because without a strong nationally and internationally recognized uh, science college, uh, we would not have been able to achieve those goals. So he was a thoughtful administrator who was respected by his faculty and staff and students and an individual whose judgment I always relied upon. It would be visionary. I think he truly is a visionary. Visionary. A visionary. The broad vision, um, the interdisciplinary um, 
vision of, uh, of signs. I think of him as a scientist and a teacher always and perhaps first and foremost. Collaborative and interdisciplinary? Um, Scholar. Focused. Cultivated, um, charming, cultured man, witty, articulate, at times a mite stubborn, and some may say they've seen that too. Um, well, he's definitely kind and compassionate. Um, in addition to that, he's, he's a very forward thinker, um, very innovative, um, and he's hilarious. Collusion. Sound a little mysterious? Complex, but, but always energetic and always with this understated brilliance, I would say. My one word would be innovative. For me, he is an innovator. He's a very humble man. Enormously gracious. I'm going to have to go with kind-hearted. Like, that is just laying off. He's just, he's kind-hearted. Well, if I had to choose <clears throat> one or two words to characterize my good friend, Lei Lam Chang, I would say he was a thoughtful gentleman. He was ever the physicist. Wise. Profound. Um, Lei Nam is a Singapore kid. He may get knocked down, but he keeps on fighting. His caring for his family the way he does. Okay, in one word, I, I can't do it, but I've decided that I will just take his last name. So, I would start with charming, hilarious, amazing, noble, and a gentleman. And then one additional thought, and this is from my son, Josh, Godfather. He's a scholar, uh, a Renaissance man. Uh, he's a foodie. Uh, he is um, a very uh, dedicated friend. I think that if I was to sum it up, it's like one of his favorite television shows, The Big Bang Theory. He really was at the advent of major change in this university.